Yeah, CB does give you more mobility. You can make more decisions, but classically what people do when they come to this branch is they move out of the center and they tend to clear the one doing one thing or the other. In the case of Firestorm, you're going to blow up a bunch of stuff and then maybe head over towards the back. Or if you're a melee character, you all, you usually prefer to go towards the back. You can stair dance though sometimes with melee characters. It's you can do it you can do some stair dancing and then move off the stairs. It just depends on uh it depends on the character in question. Well, not everybody does, Iggy. I mean, I'm stating my opinions for the way I prefer to clear it. So that's probably not going to sync with your own, but I, you know, I have like, you know, 90 wins under my belt. So I have a pretty like established way of doing it. If you talk to other experienced players, they're going to say something similar to what I'm doing. But yeah, situationally, you can negotiate all sorts of approaches to this, to this uh, map and you can do it pretty safely. Get on the kex level. Yeah, C CB uh, control blink is a is a pretty overpowered spell, but not at all required to do this map safely. Even with this kind of character, I would not say it is. I I really only need like one blink scroll, and any rest are just really for safety. I would like to have a haste pot. Uh, it's good to have a magic pot, just in case you absolutely have to have. MP restore, but with these uh, firestorming characters, most of the time I do not have C blink. I generally don't go for C blink for three room games at all. It's not that it's wrong to go for it. Um, it's but it's like 15 skill levels and translocations that I'd often put into something like fighting. I'd prefer to have more fighting on this character right now. But since I'm going into extended, C blink is definitely a spell I want to have, so that's why I actually have it now. Um, but yeah, it's a spell that gives you a bunch of options that uh, or it gives you more maneuverability so you can make decisions a little bit differently. Yeah, it's not as good as it was with the with the Zot changes. It's definitely not because now it becomes basically useless when you go to Zot. So you've got to dump in 15 uh, skill levels just for a spell that's, you know, it's really good in like maybe depths v5 or something or, or slime but you probably have a bunch of blink scrolls already and those blink scrolls are also going to be useless when you go into zot so if you don't use them it makes it makes uh control blink a lot less attractive since i mean you can still use it more if you if you have the spell but you don't really even need it to, to clear this level pretty safely It costs more than three blinks. Yeah, it's pretty good in six. Yeah, they lost C Telly as well, or minus C Telly. Oh yeah, so what was I training? Oh yeah, Evo. I guess I actually do want a good amount of fifteen for this. Not really doing me any good on this particular level, but I don't really care. Look out, Jeepicus is here with the Kraken. It's 
too soon, Jeepicus. Toad, Toad died. So, so, so recently. server please so yeah that's the benefit of this back area is that you know you're fighting like two directions most of which comes from one vault that's why it tends to be like a really people sort of get back here and clear out a seg a quadrant and then move on and clear out another one I'm gonna not really mess with that one much more even though most of it's cleared out because uh you just have to get back here and kill whatever monsters at the back. This one's a little bit less bad, although it's still not amazing. too close here. Yeah, I know, right? It's the perfect mood for this. Quicksilver, these little bastards. Pretty helpful. Firestorm blocking their shots for you. Problem is, I can't really see into the vault. So I will probably actually head up this way and go for the ones that are a bit more open. Mind me, just passing through. Concern Froge, coming to a theater near you. Mikey loves those emotes. He's all about emotes. He, he ends every sentence with an emote to express whether or not his his sentence was a joke. I actually really like uh, doing that on Twitch. It's fun for some reason. It it sort of like makes everything really like. Uh, like you're 14 years old in a, in a way, but it also keeps everything from getting uh, acrimonious, which I feel happens a lot in other, in other formats people get. Somehow the use of constant emotes makes everybody chill out a little bit. Probably it's more important if like the demographic is a lot younger in the first place. IRC is like people who tend to be a little bit older, but. Hog victory. Rufford knows what's up. Kappa is an emote. Kappa is a controversial emote, Mikey. Many uh, streamers ban Kappa because people will... They'll, they'll join the chat and they'll say something that's really, like, dickish, you know, 
and then they'll they'll add Kappa at the end like that makes up for them being a jerk. So they'll join and they're like, wow, is this like your first game? Is this the first time you've played Crawl, Kappa? I see that you're hungry and that you're, you didn't need a ration. Is this the first time you've played Crawl before, Kappa? He <laughs> thought about putting knowledge of IRC on the job offering. That's pretty funny. Yeah, no, it, you are right. It's just, I feel like, I thought about it when you said that. And I think the reason why is it just sort of like adds fun to it. If you have the right attitude about using the emotes. But it, it's definitely a thing where like every joke has to be people feel obliged to like end every single joke with a, with an emote to say like, haha, it's a funny joke. And I guess that, that probably does get old for people. But one thing I do like about Twitch is um, it's, it's just sort of a less hostile atmosphere in general, I feel. That's probably more an argument though for limiting like the amount of time you spend chatting online in the first place. But because it was outstanding in its view. Yeah, you should tell them the tell them the joke about uh the bus joke, the cashing your check joke. One where people weren't even sure if it actually was a joke. At least some people weren't. I was sure it was a joke. Apparently some people didn't get it though. Oh, also on Twitch you get the uh, the elevator music. That's something that you don't get on IRC. There's no video game elevator music. Yep, he used to be so poor he would cash his checks on the bus. He said that joke and people were like, I don't get it. Is that a joke? Dex minus five. <laughs> you have to go download all that music, load it up in your MP3 player just to hear these great tunes. It's time for that. Nobody got time to go downloading MP3 files in 2018. What's well, a shame about that Dex? I don't really want to lose my uh, EV. Even though I wouldn't. <laughs> Bust out your Zoom. God, I forgot all about Zoom. Somebody was saying it structurally, was it even a joke? Structurally? If you analyze the structure, is it actually a joke? And of course, then we had to analyze the joke structure to confirm, yes, it was a joke. There's the rune. Here we go. Three runes, I could, I could just go in. But I'm not. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do the victory parade. This is this is the last character for my greater one and one. I have uh, one and one wins for every every class already, including uh, conjurer. And uh, deep elf is the only species. I don't play too many deep elves really. I had. I have like two other deep elf wins. I just don't play them that much. They're not. I mean, they're. A harder species really in terms of like they can just die but I just don't play them too much
Yeah, see, it's a very simple joke. I don't see what the problem is. I don't know why I don't. How could you not get that joke? Oh, that's a, it's a generational thing. People are like coins. Coins on the oh, you could use cash, just cash in general. Millennials are confused. They're like, oh, cash. Oh, uh, I guess I see. A little bit too close to comfort, to be perfectly honest. I'm here, my walking meal. <laughs> like physical bitcoins. <laughs> wow. Gen Z, Gen Z kid walks onto the bus. Coins, so like, you take Bitcoin? The bus driver's like, no, we do not take Bitcoin. Yeah, the whole like currency thing kind of slipped up or kind of like it was something I really was not paying much attention to at all. And then it became, you know, Bitcoin kind of like blew up relatively recently. And I, I still don't really understand how Bitcoin works that well. I know it uses like um, it has some crazy system of like doing mining where it's like solving some math equations to actually generate the the currency so it's like spending computing power just to generate currency but i don't i still don't really understand how it works it works because people believe it will work oh it's a religion that's good it's a cult just what we needed Thank you for the host, Pekek. How many, how many, how many uh, users, Pekek? With one viewer, Pekek, who is the viewer? Who is the mystery viewer? Was it some famous uh, YouTube or Twitch celebrity? I think it was probably just you. I would assume so. Chaberdos used to come and do that to me all the time. He would uh, host, and that was the that was the joke. It was always just Chaberdos in his own chat. I guess that's actually a pretty common uh, Twitch joke these days. And you have a database, but you trust nobody in the world at all, <laughs> except you actually do. The whole set database, so you have miners who all... Uh, okay. So the database is the... So it's like a... It's sort of like a global repository where the contents are all the, the entire transaction history. That still sort of raises more questions than it answers, but I guess I just have to sit down and read about it. I mean, it's not that it, I have no interest in like getting into it, but it was just one of those things where like, oh, suddenly this is really popular and I don't really uh, understand it in any way, which I guess that's going to happen. Part of the joys of uh, becoming older is... Uh,
fads that uh, pop up that you don't get and you are distrustful and you dislike them and you dislike change. your grandma with the internet. Well, yeah, I went over to these because it's kind of easier to clear these like wide open ones that, oh, oh, that have, uh, that don't have so many walls. Although the way I'm doing this is not so hot. Monsters are not really cooperating right now. They're coming from every different direction. <laughs> oh, God. Call him. Well, that's GG. Call Imp online. Wait, how the? Oh, okay. It certainly sounds like the Wild West. Yeah, I've been doing this without any RLEC, which like sort of shows with the right kind of setup. Well, I have it as a swap. I just haven't even bothered. I mean, if you swap in RLEC, I, it's not really without RLEC. But I haven't been bothering to swap it on. Gloves of Archery. Now well, it's got Enchant, so we're going to use it. Over here. All right, so that's, that's most of that. Yeah, I've seen like some videos making fun of like uh, the marketing um, videos that look like those awful infomercials for selling products. I guess they're not infomercials, but they're like uh, those kind of like scam products that they try to get people to invest in. Hey, Mesa Variability. Look at the warp. That actually has uh, control blink as well, but I already have it because I found an artifact uh, translocation book. We really need to fix Mesa variability. I wanted to make it into a cool uh, psalm themed item, but it's, it's such a silly weapon right now. Uh, it's a kind of a somewhat wide-ranging discussion really from well that's the thing is it's it actually um, it's not plus zero it's a weird
that's what it does. It's it's very strange. It's it's not a good it's not a good weapon, but it's not actually plus zero. Oh, there's Jeepicus with his plants. He's going to start sending people plants. No, Jeepicus. That's how you look up the, the entries. Do I choose a random fixed start? That would be hilarious. Man, that would be pretty nuts. Too bad it can't actually work. I think some of those fixed starts have like weird um, restrictions that might break, that might crash, but that's a pretty funny idea. <clears throat> Scepter of Torment, yeah, that's... Sholelige, or Devastator, one turn. Scepter of Torment. Flute sword. Oh, I guess we're basically done, aren't we? Jewel gloves. Let's see what these are. This actually might be kind of handy with that, <coughs> with those fire dragon scales. Might be willing to give up, give up my uh, plus one gloves of archery. Oh, there's another Arlek ring, without the RC minus, but. Yeah, this ring is not... It's sort of a more convenient uh, Arlac swap if I actually care, but this character tends not to care too much about it. Just firestorms anything that has an Arlac attack, really. It's a little bit nicer if you're actually doing some melee. Wow, that is it. That is V5. Double chaos. Hit with two times chaos. I feel like it, since it's Zom themed, it's like the the possibilities are sort of endless. There has to be like some kind of that random artifact is a really funny idea. I don't I don't think it would actually work, but it's pretty cute. I, it would also be pretty awful to use, I, I guess. I, it's like being so crazy and unpredictable. I'd like for it to... Like Scepter of Torment is a good example of... Well... I still have, uh, so the option is still to go for fire dragon scales, I guess. Oh. Wow. And still no staff of energy, that's amazing. Well, I have not yet done either 
Crypt, nor Slime. That's going to eat through a bunch of rations, though. I'm fine for now. And I still have not... I said I was going to go for Necromutation, but I haven't seen it. I don't have the... I should probably get a low-level transmutation spell so I can train team mute I will do that for now I'm not sure I'm actually gonna train it right now but there's no point in training any more Evo since I would like to maybe get some more fighting or something Ugh. Uh, actually I did not have gourmand on this character I had a MP regen. I never used Gourmand, but it is true that that is an option. It's just that uh, I'm going into those. And yeah, it's not going to be a problem, but the thing is I'm going to start going into Extended. So eventually, the longer I don't find some of those things, it could be a problem. Um, I can also just get 27 spellcasting, though. It's just a thing I want to sort of avoid if I can. But oddly enough, none of those uh, usual things have dropped.